Yo, what's going on gamers? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are all having a great day. Hope you had a great holiday, had a little time to take off, relax a little bit. Um, guys, I appreciate you all stopping by the channel. If you guys have been enjoying the content I've been producing, if you could leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel, it would mean the world to me. But even if you can't, guys, I appreciate you stopping by and giving support to the channel and watching the videos. And with that being said, let's get into this video, guys. So I was reading the Fortnite Reddit today, as I kind of do regularly, and I saw a suggestion that actually was a great idea to me. Um, I will put a link down below to the Reddit post uh, where I saw this idea come from, so I give credit to them. The topic was about adding an app to the game that you could access from your phone. And this hit me like a ton of bricks, guys. This would be amazing. Um, and what I saw within the post itself is that apparently um, Epic Games sent out a survey or a feedback survey a little while ago that mentioned an opt-in chance for an app. So an app is coming to the game most likely. And I wanted to talk a little bit about what I would like to see in the app. Again, these are just my opinions, guys. These are just some suggestions. Obviously, you guys are going to have different ones other than mine, and I would like to actually see those if you would leave them in the comments down below. I think it would be interesting to see the different ideas that we all have for this game. Uh, first thing I would like to see and foremost is a backpack manager. The reason for this is I think it would be great in the game if you could access your backpack not within the map. If you had the chance to go in and recycle schematics, recycle weapons, get rid of some of those whites that you've picked up so you can clear up your backpack space before you get into a map. I have seen many other people also wish that this was implemented into the game, uh, not in the app, but just in the menus. Uh, so when you're not in the game, you can access it. So I definitely think this is on top of the priority list for what they could include in the app. Next, which I think rivals the backpack manager is the squads manager. Um, obviously, tweaking your squads takes a lot of time and effort, and if you were able to sit down and open up an app when you're sitting in, let's say, a doctor's office, or you're getting your tires rotated, or you're waiting for class to start, if you could do that, it would free up more time for you to be able to play the game when you're actually in the game because you could knock out some of that more time-consuming menu action while you're just sitting around doing nothing. Next, I would suggest having a hero manager. Uh, again, you know, this isn't as extensive as the squad manager, but it would be nice to be able to go in, see what heroes you have, what hero you currently have equipped, what two heroes you currently have in the squad bonus slots so you can see what bonuses you're activating, and then be able to move them around and tweak them so next time you got on, you could just jump right into the game and play how you want to play it. Next, I would like to see the research and skill trees accessible. Uh, I'm going to explain why for a couple of different reasons. The first one is I would like to be able to collect the research and the skill points when I'm not in the game. I know the point of this is to get players to log on to collect their points and get them playing, but I think that Epic should reward their loyal gamers and allow them to not only collect them inside the game but outside of the game because life happens guys sometimes I can't get on before my skill points or research points fill their max slot but I love playing the game and I put a lot of time in the game so it would feel good if I could still get credit for those points without having to be able to log into the game as well as just having access to be able to see the different research nodes so I could know which way maybe I wanted to go, which way I wanted to make my upgrades, so I didn't have to spend time when I log in every night looking at that before I actually jump into the game. Coming next, I would like to see access to the collection book because again, this is just another thing that is time consuming when you log on every day and being able to knock it out of the way before you get on will again free up more time for you to enjoy the game. The last thing I would like to see, I debated whether or not I wanted to include in the video because I haven't really convinced myself if I would like to see it or not, but is to have the ability to craft things from the app. Uh, so let's say you're going to do a 14 night survive the storm mission. You can go ahead and craft a bunch of those traps that you're going to need or you can go ahead and craft a bunch of that ammo uh, while you're sitting around so that way you don't have to waste that time when you get on that night. Because we all know that the survive the storm missions are already a big time sink. So being able to get some of that prep out of the way without having to waste your time that you want to use playing the game would be definitely helpful. The debate in my head comes from is the crafting 
during the game supposed to be part of the key part of the game. Um, if it's not, and you guys agree with me that you should be able to craft outside, I would like to hear down below. Or if you think it is a key part of the game that needs to stay where you can only craft when you're inside of a map, I would like to hear that down below and why. Uh, because I haven't really convinced myself, so I would like to actually get some help from you guys to decide how I see the subject. And there you have you guys. Uh, that's my opinion on what they should do if they do add an app to the game. I hope you've enjoyed the content, and I would like to see your opinions down below. And if you enjoyed the content, if you could drop a like and subscribe to the channel, it would mean the world to me. And I hope you guys all have a good one.